So last Friday, I get a phone call from my daughter's teacher. She's in fifth grade. She's 11 years old. Um, and her teacher told me that my daughter had drawn something inappropriate in the art class and that a little boy had come up to her and made her aware that he thought my daughter drew boy parts on her pig project. Um, so she went over and asked my daughter for all of her papers to which my daughter kind of like nervously laughed and um, apparently like she'd overheard my daughter like sh sh you know the other kids because everybody's making a big deal out of what they think she drew. Um, and my daughter told the teacher right away that she drew a bow tie. And the teacher proceeded to take all of her papers from her. Um, and then she said she had to give my daughter's project to the vice principal at the school to handle on Tuesday because Martin Luther King Day was yesterday. So um, it kind of worked out because I had to take my daughter to school this morning anyways after a doctor's appointment and I figured I want to see this art project and I want to address this. So I get there this morning and they take me into a conference room and I sit down with her teacher and the social worker for the school and they hand me her art project that was just so offensive and um, as soon as I look at it I'm like are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Like I literally slammed my hand down on the table and I said, to be completely frank with you, I am pissed. Like, why are we sitting here right now? And why was there a big deal made out of this? Like it's a freaking bow tie. So they tell me that when they gave it to the principal, um, they, to ask him like what his thoughts were on this whole thing, his first, his first thing that he said was, write her up. Write her up with the, the, the artwork that he's seen. So I was like, well, great, let's bring him in because I would love to have a chat with him too. Let's bring him in. So he comes in and, um, you know, I point to it and I said, it's it's a freaking bow tie. And he goes, a bow tie is a bow. And me, I'm like, I'm sorry, my daughter's no Monet. Um, but to her, a bow tie is a bow and a tie. And if another kid happened to look at it and think that it was something else, that sounds more like a he problem, not a she problem. And why you're making this my daughter's problem, I don't know. I don't know. So he proceeds to tell me that, you know, this time he won't give my daughter a write-up, but he was going to put her artwork into a folder in case any future incidences come up where she's inappropriate, which my daughter has never been inappropriate. She has never even talked about boy parts, girl parts has never drawn anything at home, at school, anything. So I asked him, why is he even putting it into a folder or a file? Because there's nothing that she did wrong to bring up and, and hold against her later anyway. So I'm super confused and I'm gonna include my daughter's artwork at the end of this video so y'all can see what I'm dealing with. It's bull crap. And I can see where an 11 year old boy might have looked at her artwork and seen something different, but I feel like that's where her teacher should have shut it down and said, you know, you might think that's what she drew, but it is not what she drew. And she's saying it's a bow tie. Um, you know, it could have been shut down and it could have been stopped, but it was not.